welcome back guys for another LEGO review today and I know you guys are like uh where have you been and I have been very 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 busy this past summer um, and I know I could go on forever and tell you guys every little thing that I did let's just say I've been on like four different vacations and just all this prep work for college and all that stuff that is fun with my personal life and uh, just had to put this on the back seat and I know I've been active on my other channel my gaming channel if you guys didn't know about that team 111 gaming will be down in the description below um, I've been a lot more busy on that um, because it's just easier and um, doesn't require me to spend a lot of money like Lego does um, but you know what? I have all these figures and it's not that hard to, and I still love it. So, um, here we go, uh, <laughs> I, uh, with a little exclamation of where I've been. But yeah, this is a Lego Christo Plastic Man. And no, this is not the one that you're gonna get, um, from pre-ordering the Lego Batman 3 video game with GameStop. This is, um, the one that Christo made a while ago. Um, so yeah, let's take a look at it. He is very cool. If you guys don't know Plastic Man, he is a Justice League member, and he's been featured on quite a number of TV shows like Young Just. And uh, what else has he been on? He's been on Brave and the Bold. He's been on quite a few things. And if you guys don't know, his power is he is able to stretch his limbs. He's basically like Mr. Fantastic from the Fantastic Four, um, but in the DC realm. So let's take a look at him. He's actually a pretty cool. Um, character, he does have like this headpiece is like the um, the Superman hairpiece, um, which is very cool and it does fit him very well. Uh, maybe I'll insert a picture somewhere of him. Uh, he is a very very cool minifigure or a very very cool person, so I'll insert a picture showing him. And then down he has kind of like a laced V neck, and it's very cool down to like the pec design, which is very cool for Lego superhero minifigures and his striped yellow kind of bubble bee color black and yellow um, belt there across the bottom and he does have the flesh legs which are very hard to come by um, because I know because I was trying to do a Jason Todd uh, Robin um, or it could be a Dick Grayson whatever one you want and and people do want me to review that which I will definitely because my friend Ross painted the legs on that and I'd love to show my own little um, custom or I could try painting them myself who knows and then on the back here we have the belt again, and uh, the shoulder, and all that stuff. And he does have the red arms, and very cool. In the face he has his nice iconic yellow sunglasses. Yellow sunglasses, I'm colorblind. White glasses there with the blue lines in the middle, kind of showing like the sun streaking with his big smile. He's a very goofy person. Um, that's just who he is, and he's just a really cool Justice League member. So yeah, that is it guys um, for a nice quick review of him. All of Chris's stuff will be down in the description below. He has his own website where he sells all of his stuff. Like you can see the background. I have my um, Red Robin and my Flash in the background. I kind of have, I try to feature the actual customizer stuff in the background uh, that I have also. So um, down here you can't see it. it's like Black Lightning and I've also done Reverse Flash. Which people saying it's Professor Zoom. I was just going off of what Christo posted, so calm down, people. And yeah, so I hope you guys are happy that I'm back. Uh, I do plan on doing a lot of stuff. I know Lego just recently released at San Diego Comic Con the Green Lantern set and the Tumblr set, like pictures of that stuff, so definitely on there. Uh, Guardians of the Galaxy stuff. I know I reviewed every single Lego superhero set that Lego has ever made that's not exclusive, just normal line stuff. And uh, I didn't do the Guardian stuff because I was down my little hiatus, so unfortunately I won't be able to do those. Still don't have them. I'm probably going to wait to get them till like Christmas time where they're all on sale. But yeah, uh, thank you guys. I hope you enjoyed. Please leave a like and comment down below if you could have... <laughs> I know I haven't said this in a while, but if you could see a comic book hero in Le or villain, ooh, jeez, <laughs> in Lego, who would it be and why? And um, also on my channel, I have all my other Lego superhero stuff. Uh, I love superheroes. It's one of my favorite things. And um, I hope you guys enjoyed. We'll see you next time, and goodbye.